Look at this out of the box. It's almost damaged, even though this box is brand new. Either way, let's get into today's video. What's up, everyone? This is G Shock Half Fashion Channel back here with another G Shock unboxing video. 1545 model, same as the one that I'm wearing over here. Bam. This is not mine. This is from a friend of mine. I just Ask him if I could borrow his watch to make an unboxing video about first before I return it back to him. So that's why I'm wearing my DW600 G-Shock in life collaboration as well today. I barely wear this watch to a point that I almost forgot I own this in my collection, you know what I mean? Reference number DW5600RR-1JF. This is the rock and roll team for G-Shock model from the G-Mix team. Casio have been creating G-Shocks that is related with music team way back from 1997 on their DW003HH a watch that could measure beat per minute so very interesting piece of that starting from there and everything evolved and this is one of it and now we have this guy here all this have the same musical team as well it features a classic bull bar that gives this a very rock and roll metal strength type of vibes to this as well the most interesting part about this release is that it come in this steel band keeper for some reason i found it interesting and unique and this is one of it so that's why i bought this was the first place even though i already sell this but it's fine i still have it in here glossy chrome band keeper with this sort of like texture on top of it as well the buckle is not that glossy compared to this band keeper however it has Casio Japan sign below it so it's very interesting every 1545 module watch have the same features best thing I'll show you guys what's up they did in time at timekeeping mode we're gonna have the alarm a timer a stopwatch and back to timekeeping mode they are pretty much simple and one more interesting part about this specific model you have a very interesting backlight logo which features a guitar for rock and roll team with fiery flame design the thing that I like is of course the buckle but in this specific case however it's kind of annoying because this band, this band keeper over here is, is, isn't that wide so it's pretty hard for me to put this band into the loop I guess so very very annoying and very time consuming as well that that is the only downside about this release model just like that I'm gonna put it off all the way three like that so look at that both of these have same matte colorway black all over however this guy somehow just stand out the most above this guy over here just look at that just simple metal parts really make a huge difference and this guy only priced about 12,000 yen during the day of its release it is slick it is classic design everybody knows this square piece it is small simple timekeeping mode only and still features a great design very tough you probably gonna destroy the band and bezel first before destroy the band keeper on this type of model very interesting idea i really love this man i hope you guys found this video useful and also stay tuned for another g mix that actually controlling music not just some music team unlike this guy over here this is the deal, this is the evolution of this piece. Leave a like and also subscribe for more G-Shock related contents like all this in the future. Thank you very much for watching guys. This is G-Shock Half Fashion Channel and I'm... Um